In Coachella tonight, the first ever Farm Cella to celebrate the hard work of farm workers in the valley. News Channel 3's Samantha Lomidao is joining us live from Veterans Memorial Park where the festival is underway. Sam, looks like a good turnout. Karen, a really great turnout right now, and I'm sure you can hear that mariachi music in the back. Now, this is all happening as hundreds, I'm telling you, hundreds of farm workers, people are here collecting their items, and there's still another line wrapped around the library today. Now, the founder of the nonprofit who organized Farm Cella tells me it's an event to honor the hard work they do every single day while making it feel like home. Farm Cella the first ever farm workers festival in Coachella. We want farm workers to feel honored, to be appreciated. We want their kids and themselves to leave feeling very proud of the farm workers in their lives. It's put together by the Celebration Nation Foundation, a nonprofit uplifting Latin and indigenous people, along with farm worker advocacy. Founder Flor Martinez Arcosa tells me Farm Cella is a way to recognize farm workers. We want them to, to know that there's a community that that's here for them, that they're no, they're no longer in the shadows. It's time to share their stories and story tell their stories. Martina Sargosa was a farm worker herself at just 14 years old. Her firsthand experiences drove the creation of her nonprofit and inspired her to put on a celebration for those out in the fields day in and day out. A lot of people think that Coachella is just the festival, right? But it's actually a city, a valley, a home to thousands of farm workers that endure the climate changes, the pesticide dust, and just the living conditions that are below poverty lines. Farmcella features music and food, but it also provides farm workers with essential items. We have a lot of produce to give back to them. We have a lot of home essentials and personal hygiene essentials. And we also have clothing uh, for mom, dad, the, the, the kids. And they're always struggling with food insecurity themselves. And, and it's just really ironic because they're the ones that provide us with the food security we need for this nation. On top of that, the festival is also providing resources for farm workers, including educational, legal representation, and mental health. Everyone here is on the same mission to help our farm workers and just make them feel like they belong. Martina Sargosa says the efforts of farm workers should be recognized every day. To acknowledge them and just make them feel empowered and appreciated and in community. And as you can see, the community turned out tonight. You saw this setup, and now you're seeing this turnout. Hundreds of people here at Farm Cella, and a couple hundreds more still waiting to come inside. It is going until 7:30 tonight in downtown Coachella. Come around; you can still have an hour to check out the live music that's happening. Now, if you'd like to donate or volunteer with the nonprofit and help out, you can find more on our website, kesq.com. Live in Coachella, Samantha Lumibau, News Channel 3.